Hello, my name is Pierre Mont. I'm giving this presentation um, on model edit phenotyping with my co authors, Triang Liu and Fred Barry. The main challenge today uh, for plant phenotyping is to transform big data into knowledge. This requires articulated workflows that integrate uh, different types of model with increasing interpretation complexity and prior knowledge of physical processes. Facilitate the development of workflows for phenomics, we have developed the digital plant phenotyping platform that I will here briefly present. This platform uh, uses functional structural plant model integrated in the OpenAI platform to simulate uh, the group of 3D uh, virtual canopies. These canopy are analyzed um, using simulators of RGB multispectral or LIDAR sensor, which produced images and pan clouds of the canopies, which are then analyzed using uh, different types of relative transfer model uh, to estimate uh, canopy state variables and parameter. Thousands of canopy can easily be uh, generated in D3P by perturbating the inputs of the model, including the meteorological conditions, uh, the crop management uh, parameter and the crop parameter. So we generated over 2000 uh, virtual canopy uh, that we used uh, to, to train a neural network. This, train, this neural network was trained to um, estimate a number of parameters of a 3D model and also a state variable of the of the canopy, including green area index or the fraction of intercepted light by the canopy. The trained neural network can then be used uh, to estimate trait and state variables of the canopies uh, from uh, pseudo observation or real observation. Here I will briefly uh, present some uh, results on the dynamics of canopy structure and light interception. Uh, for wheat crops grown in the field over different uh, years and different uh, irrigation uh, scenarios. So you could see here um, estimation uh, with the D3P platform of the fraction of intercepted uh, power, the green area index and the um, average leaf uh, angle distribution of the canopy. Most of the parameter where we try with uh, a good accuracy and, and a high irritability and a high irritability. Thank you for listening to this short presentation. Uh, please take the time to follow the full presentation and I uh, will be happy to answer your question on the day of the conference. Thank you very much and goodbye.